This will be a virtual launch, so expect it to be a speedy livestream that gets through a variety of products in quick succession. Apple Spring events tend to last around two hours, and we'll be here to talk you through what's happening on the stream as it's announced. Before the event starts, we'll be talking you through what to expect and any last-minute leaks that appear throughout the day. How to watch Apple Spring Loaded event all times are in Pacific Standard Time, PST, 714 Tim Cook is awake and he's at work, or, his social media manager is up, bright and early instead. How do we know? Because Cook has sent his first tweet of the day. It's a beautiful spring morning for an hashtag Apple event. See you soon. Pick.twitter.com slash Gadan OQXBZ5 April 20th 2021 See more 630 Apple AirPods 3, where are those true wireless headphones we've heard so much about? Olivia Tambini, audio and music editor for TechRadar, says, We've been hearing rumors about the Apple AirPods 3 for a while now, and everything is pointing to a 2021 release, and with the event happening later today, we're hopeful that Apple will take the opportunity to show off the next generation of its true wireless earbuds. Of course, nothing is certain at this stage, and we've also heard conflicting rumors that the AirPods 3 won't enter production until the third quarter of this year, potentially launching alongside the next iPhone in September. Plus, we've also been hearing rumors that the next AirPods Pro could launch in April, so we may see the AirPods Pro 2 be announced today instead. In any case, we'll definitely be keeping our eyes peeled for a AirPods or AirPods Pro announcement today. Everything you need to know about Apple AirPods 305 to 30 now is when the rumored products start to become less likely, although we may see the iPad Mini 6 arrive later today. Ming-Chi Kuo, an analyst with a great track record for Apple leaks, has said to expect this slate in the first half of the year, and John Prosser has said that he's heard iPads are coming in March, which would be almost right if it lands in April. The iPad Mini, 2019, image credit, TechRadar, the plural there suggests multiple models, so it's not out of the question that the iPad Pro, 2021, and iPad Mini 6 could both show up. That said, we've heard fewer release date rumors about the iPad Mini 6, so we'd say it's less likely to show up than the iPad Pro, 2021. Whenever it does arrive, rumors suggest it might have a slightly larger 8.5-inch screen, up from the 7.9-inch one used by the iPad Mini, 2019. It might also stick with the Lightning port, rather than switching to USB-C, and use an A13 Bionic chipset, like the iPhone 11 range. Everything we know about the iPad Mini 6 image credit, Apple, 412 The Apple Store is down, so you won't be able to buy any new products from the company for the next few hours ahead of the launch event while the team tinkers behind the scenes.